Dr. Karthik. I congratulate Dr. Karthik for scoring topmost rank in clinical hematology in AIMS 2021 and DM clinical hematology rank number four. Uh, yes, thank, thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. It gives immense pleasure to see you, sir. Congratulations to you. Sir, thank you so much, sir. Can we know something about Dr. Karthik? Where he did his medicine, where he did his MD, and why did why did he want to do? Yes, sir. Uh, sir, basically, I belong to uh, Chennai, sir. But I got uh, I did my undergraduation in uh, Thoothukudi Medical College, sir. Government Thoothukudi Medical College. And uh, after one year preparation for PG, I got uh, MD General Medicine in uh, Kanyakumari Medical College, the Government Kanyakumari Medical College. Uh, so the, our my uh, post graduation center. Uh, which is Kanyakumari Medical College acted as a nodal center for hemophilia in uh, southern district, sir. So my head of the departments and uh, everyone will be more uh, cautious towards uh, the hemophilia patients and hematology department. Then, uh, then basically I had some uh, interest over uh, hematology, malignant hematology related cases. Sir. So we did. Uh, so we usually do uh, some case presentations and. Uh, Everything we will do based on only I will do based on only hematology, the bone marrow, uh, bone marrow exam. So it created a, gives me some confidence. So, uh, so we should take uh, hematology. Then uh, so which created interest. Basically, my brother is also worked in CMC. Sir. So I used to see, I used to go to uh, Christian Medical College and uh, see some. Uh, so there is a uh, big uh, bone marrow transplant center, and more uh, more amount of uh, hematology cases will be there. Then I usually just see and come. Uh, so it gives me some interest towards that. Uh, so basically, uh, so I, uh, so whether to know whether I, I, I have some hematology interest. So I gave some I need super uh, need super specialty last year. Right? It gives me it get a good rank. For, it get me a good rank. So I started preparing last year. Right? Can you tell us something about your preparation strategy? So the, the preparation strategy, sir. Uh, since I didn't, uh, since my post graduation, I did in a uh, government setup. So I used to do. Uh, we have been used to do uh, uh, bonds. Uh, we should used to do bond. So since there is a COVID times, we have been posted in Chennai itself, and uh, one year has been continued for COVID uh, COVID duties. So uh, at that time, I used to do only. Uh, so the concept is simple. Sir, used to take. Uh, I used to attend classes and I take notes and I revise that notes. So basically, I didn't go so much into test textbooks. Sir. So my advice is that don't go towards the textbook. Just read the classes and uh, revise the classes. That will be more than enough uh, for for uh, preparation. Sir. Just I uh, for uh, the compilation of the what you take notes will be uh, one month will be enough. I think so. Sir. If you take uh, for past six months, if you take notes, that one month uh, before the exam, if you revise the notes, that will be more than enough. I think so. Sir. Can we know how long was your preparation? It basically, it started from last year, sir. Uh, last year, I started uh, not that much effectively, but uh, for the last uh, four months, I started effectively, sir. By attending COVID duties on the quarantine period, I started uh, uh, a bit effectively last, last four months, sir. Uh, uh, so, I, uh, basically, I don't prepare for uh, AIMS exam, but I prepared for, I targeted for uh, need super specialty only, sir. Uh, but uh, I got uh, selected in AIMS itself. Uh, that's <laughs> that's due to God's grace. <laughs> so because I targeted the CMC, I targeted CMC, so I prepared for each super specialty only. Uh, but uh, in the meantime, it's okay to do an uh, in an institute setup. Uh, to do hematology in an institute setup is better than any, doing any other hematology setups. So. You read any super specialty textbooks? No, sir. So seriously, I didn't read any super specialty textbooks, sir. I just uh, have a half man's manual, uh, half man's manual that do in a PDF format. So that after attending the classes, I just to read them some table columns and uh, note the MCQs and extra MCQs uh, if at all I can see that. That's uh, that's it, sir. But I didn't read any textbooks seriously, sir. Are the class videos enough? Are the class videos enough? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Definitely more than enough, sir. Yeah. Uh, for hematology, in my pers uh, personal opinion, it is more than enough if we attend classes, sir. They also join in another... Uh, I also attended some hematologist classes, sir. I also attended CMC conferences. 
Uh, there we used to get some notes, some uh, PowerPoint presentations we will get. So uh, on compiling these two, I think it's more than enough to attend an uh, uh, institute exam. Sir. Okay. So once again, I wish you all the best, all the success as a great hematologist in years to come. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir.